guys, welcome to another video. My name is Giselle and I am a homeschooling mom to my little girl Isabella. On this channel, I love sharing all about our homeschooling journey. And in today's video, I will be sharing some of our favorite gifts for the holidays from past years that are both fun and educational. This is part of a collaboration hosted by Sarah from Blessed Homeschool. So it is basically a gift guide that has been put together. I will be linking the playlist down below so that you can see what other mommies recommend for gifts that are both fun and educational. So I will be sharing many of the things that we have loved in the past years but there is one item that I want to highlight and I will leave that for last. All of these things I do recommend. I know that my little one has had some lovely experiences with them. So the first one is this wooden um, cashier's register and um, this one of course promotes math skills as well as pretend playing and just imagining that she is a cashier or that she's buying something at a store and so there are so many ways to play with this and it is educational. It comes with a little scanner and also a credit card, debit card box. Last year we also got her this terrarium so it's like a little kit that comes with soil pebbles and seeds um so that you can create your own little terrarium it is light up so it is so cute and it has even little figurines that you can place inside of it um stickers on the outside it was so much fun and um of course, we already did this one, that is why the little container is empty, but I did go back and see if they sold any refill packages, and they do, and they're not expensive at all, they're only $10, so we could do this again if we wanted to, and so that is another recommendation. And then the following items are things that are for exploration. They are scientific tools and I, just a little reminder, scientific tools make great gifts for children because they are educational but they are also so much fun. And I know that my little one um, has gotten so excited to receive these and so it is a great idea. So the first one I is this magnifying glass and I got this pretty pink one from Melissa and Doug and she loves this one. She loves to go looking for insects in the summer and so she takes this with her. So it is great to promote exploration um, of the world around them and also I think it helps them feel like little scientists and it's just so so cute and I think this is also a great gift for them. And I also got her this microscope and she loves this one. She loves to look at random things even around the house. Like she loves looking at leaves and just anything that she finds. She'll, she wants to look at it through the microscope. It comes with um, other scientific tools. It comes with tweezers and blank slides um, and also a lab guide. So it comes with other things. Um, and it also comes with some pebbles and little rocks that they can um, look at through the microscope. And so it is so nice to have and also a great gift. And so this is the item that I really, really wanted to tell you about. And it is based on the TV series Number Blocks. So if you haven't seen those they are so so cute they are for promoting math skills uh, mostly counting numbers and they do this in such a creative way so basically the blocks are actual characters and they each represent a number and they are so so cute they have their own personality and they go through different adventures in which they explore those math skills 
and they are just so helpful to reinforce those mathematical skills in our little ones and they have so many products like toys and, and books that little ones can play with and so they get so excited to receive these. I know my little one loves this. It is in a in a little bin because the actual box um, got completely destroyed. She has played with this so much. Um, but I wanted to show you. So it is a set of blocks, different colors, um, but they can create the actual characters with the blocks. For example, this one, this one is number three. So as you can see, it has the little face. It is so cute. And so they can um, create the characters. Or they can also play with the blocks just randomly. Like my little one likes to build things. She has also um, created her own characters. So there are so many ways that they can play with it. It comes with a set of cards um, so that they can look at the different characters. And, and that way they have a visual reference when they are making them. So these little cards are so helpful. And also, it has these cards. These are a little bit bigger. They are basically like little mats where they can recreate some of the episodes. And of course, each episode, again, is reinforcing and targeting a certain math skill. And so these little activities do the same. So this one is based on an episode um, titled Blockzilla. And it is a creature that likes to eat bigger numbers. And so it is perfect for, um, for, for practicing uh, the math skill of comparing numbers. So less than, more than. And so it is just so, so cute. So this one is the one that I highly recommend. I know my little one has played with it so, so much. She has, she loves it. This and set is from numbers 1 to 10, but I know there's another set that comes with numbers from 10 to 20, I believe. So I will be getting her that set this Christmas. Um, and like I said, these are so nice to have. They are so good at um, reinforcing those math skills, like I said. And I think it would make a great gift. And I also recommend the cartoons. They, they are so cute. They are so creative in the way that they um, expose little ones to those math skills, to counting um, especially. And um, I do recommend them. I know that children are not to spend too much time in front of the TV, but a few minutes um, each day, I think it would be, this would be a great option. It's highly educational. And so that is it. Those are my recommendations. Please don't forget to look at the, to click on the playlist down below so that you can see what other mommies are recommending so that you can get more ideas. Um, also, I also wanted to say that, and that I am also going to get her the magnet tiles this year. I'm so excited about those. I have heard so many good things and um, I know that she will love them because she loves building things and so I know she's going to love it. So I do want to mention that. And um, But that's it. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I do hope to see you in the next video.